In this video, we are going to talk about how to express number sequences by using term-to-term -term rule. A sequence is a set of numbers described by a rule. For example, if I write, let's say, 3, 8, 13, 18, and so on, Right, I can see that the difference is always 5 between those sequ uh, terms of the sequence. Right, so what happens is if I add 5, I find the next term. So basically, the next two terms, for example, would be like 23 when I add 5 to 17, sorry, 18, and then 28 when I add 5 to 23. Right, this goes on like that. So they are listed, those, those terms are listed according to a rule. The rule is add 5 to the previous term. So this is called as term to term rule because you define one term depending on the previous term. So if you know the previous term, according to this given term-to-term -term rule, you can find the next term. So that's how it works. Let's see another example. A number sequence is defined as follows. The first term is 3. Okay. Each new term is double the previous one. Hmm. So I will go like 2 times 3. I'm doubling 3. It's 6. So the next term will be 6. And then I will double 6 to get 12, so the third term will be 12, and then I will double 12 to get the fourth term, which would be 24, and this goes on forever until I'm bored. Right, so it says, use this rule to generate the first five terms. Okay, so I'll go one more, 2 times 24, I will get 48, so the fifth term will be 48. Now that the question says first five terms, I will include the first term in my list. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five terms. But basically, I will be calculating four new terms. Right? So this is how term to term rule works. You have to be given the first term, and then you have to be given a rule which is based on the previous term or the given first term initially. And then you calculate all the next terms, right, like that, depending on the rule and the previous term. Let's look at this example. A number sequence is defined as follows. The first term is 7, and each new term is 3 more than the previous one. Use this tool rule to generate the first six terms of the number sequence, well, including the first term which is already given. So, I start with 7, and then each new term is 3 more, okay, then it's 7 plus 3, which is 10. So I can write my second term to be 10. 10 plus 3 is 13, and so on. I mean, we can do all the calculations mentally. I don't need to show this as work, right? I can go like 7, 10, 13, 16, 19, and the sixth term to be 22. So, I'm done. Now, please try these exercises. Solve on your book and submit your answers online. Thank you.